West Michigan scientists are continuing their search for Lake Sturgeon in the Grand River after discovering evidence of successful natural reproduction. 13 on your side's Andrea Flores is here now with the story. Juliet, a team of conservationists are still out there on the Grand River tonight hoping to see another juvenile Lake Sturgeon. In the Grand River, there's not a lot known about Lake Sturgeon. This team is laying out their boating plan. We have uh, two large Q-beams, which are large uh, flashlights, and two people in the front of the boat um, use those Q-beams to spot along um, in the shallow kind of um, gravel habitat. And loading up before riding the Grand River to look for Lake Sturgeon. On our first survey out for the season, we actually were able to locate and capture one of the juvenile sturgeon. The fish they caught and released was a four-month-old Lake Sturgeon which is believed to be evidence of the first successful natural reproduction on record. From that, we can figure out a lot about the population dynamics, especially if we can catch some more. The Grand Rapids Public Museum, John Ball Zoo, and Grand Valley State University joined together on this documentation project. Consulting firm Encompass and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service are helping out too. So they're going to start mapping the locations where those juveniles may be and do some habitat suitability. It's all part of an effort to protect the species. The lake sturgeon um, is a very large fish. Uh, they're a long-lived fish. Um, and they're an iconic fish uh, that a lot of people uh, recognize. Lake sturgeon are classified as threatened in Michigan. So it's important for us other biologists, uh, the people of Michigan, and state agencies like Michigan Department of Natural Resources do what they can to preserve uh, those, spe those populations. The conditions have to be perfect for crews to go out looking with calm weather and clear water. The team is hoping to find more juvenile lake sturgeon this year to continue to document their population in the Grand River. Juliet. Andrea, thank you.